So uh, I lapse, I apologize into a trolling event on the ETC Classic um, uh, Slack. And as a result, I've been punished and thrown into the ETC Phantom Stockhouse for a week. So I'll be not posting or not sharing any information. I will be sharing information, but just in my channel. So I want to apologize to any of those offended by my trolling lapse. And, but I want to explain to you what's going on here. And it's really, you know, people need to understand. You know, I'm in this for one thing only, and that's saving our planet. I'm not in it for the money. I just walked away, and I can show you the proposal. I walked away from $200 million valuation last week to own Foundups. That's right, to own Foundups. No one's going to own Foundups. Kind of like your, uh, a lot of people's feeling. Okay, how do you get thought? Um, and... Uh, and basically, uh, there are a couple agendas in ETC, and I don't know. And, and, and obviously, you know, both Charles and Avatar say, "Well, we're not. I don't have any ETC." So, if you don't have any ETC, then Charles, what is your agenda? Because you're you're either in it. You're not going to be. You're either okay. If you're not in it to make money, well, you have a company, and obviously, you want your. You know, you're 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 you're, you're, you're putting money in, and you are not. Um, you know, you're not a selfless person, okay? You're definitely not a selfless person um, because ultimately if you were a selfless person, uh, you would just be donating to, you'd set up a nonprofit and just donate your money instead of hiring developers and allow that funding to go to anyone. So, so the only other course then, what, what, what you're doing, Charles, is, is a vendetta. It's a vendetta. And you know what? I can see that because when I was at the event, no one had anything nice to say about you. They hated you. They, they, they talked bad about you. They just said you were a complete loser. I'm just sharing what came out of all the ETC Foundation people about you, okay? If the truth hurts, the truth hurts. But basically, you are hated. Why are you hated? Why don't you make a talk and tell me why they hate you so much? Because they vehemently hate you. And I have not seen that in any other place. So obviously, um, this is a vendetta pool for you. And your, jaw, your goal is just to kill Ethereum, Ethereum, right? Just take it, take it out, so admit it. So if you're not in it for the money, if you don't have ETC, right? And you're not in it because you're not selfless, because you're obviously not selfless, because you would have reached, if I, because I am selfless, right? And I have all the proof of that. Um, and uh, then it has to be that. And then Avatar, who constantly says, oh, I, you know, I don't want power, I don't want power, I don't want power, runs around setting up meetup groups uh, and, and everything else. So the fact is, all that volume, you know, people say like, because, oh, it was because of the hack. No, the hack actually happened technically on the 18th, because remember, we're a day ahead. The 19th in the morning would have been the 18th at night. If you look at that volume, people, there is actually not hardly any change in the volume. Now, the volume actually moved when ETC heard, or ETH heard, and I was walking around their party saying, I've raised $5 million. And there might be, want to meet my investors? Uh, Lupin met with my investors. Uh, a host of other people met with my investors. Dre, Dre, Dom with my investors. My investors basically were throwing the party. I walked around with glasses and everyone's eyes and pretty much the entire volume that you see I was wrong to think it was it was it was um, Shan Legal. Shan Le, actually Shan Legal was working too because Shan Legal was basically, and I have this from a reliable source, and actually Mike can back this up. Is um, is um, I have this from a reliable source when I did this huge dive bomb into the uh, um, into the pool and this VC who knew like all the history and I had this huge argument that Mike over was there to, to witness, basically said that Gal was, was gonna be leaving and was gonna be dumping. And this was before I learned about his planned move because like there's no way Gal's gonna do this, no way Gal's gonna do this. That would have been on the 19th, 20th on your time, I think that's, uh, yeah, 19th or 20th. And then finally, the next day, which would have been on the 20th, uh, for me it would have been the 21st, okay? My five million in the morning went to 10 million. And I'm walking around 
shared the news. They were like, I thought it was five. No, well, it was five and now it's 10. <laughs> so, uh, so the entire volume is proof that one guy, that would be me, Michael Trout, walking the talk, walking the walk, talking the talk with ETC, not hiding like a fucking dog with my tail between their legs like you were, right? Like I said in my post, you are a dog hiding with your tail between your legs. You don't have the balls to go to DevCon because you know you're just scared. You're a little girl, Charles, probably. I don't understand. I'm not scared of anything. I'm not scared of Shen Legal. I see it as it is. And as soon as I found out that he was dumping, at first I was going to use it. I'll be honest with you. I was like, you can trust Daniel. You can talk to Petronix. I warned them. I said, listen, a dump's coming. There was a dump. Boom, boom, boom. Right? And I realized that this is wrong because some people are going to get hurt. So I realized that the only right thing to do Unlike you, you're just hiding, hiding behind some, some, some ego, her ego, right? Is to share what I believe is happening, and in sharing, so yeah, it makes me like a tool because now Chandler isn't going to make that move, and I'm left here. So and, oh, you'll never know. But I saved people. I helped people. Miners don't care, you know. Traders don't care. But the, but the guy that comes in and all of a sudden comes in it comes in at a dollar twenty and it drops down to twenty cents and he put everything in at a dollar twenty, that person there is screwed. He's fucked, right? Potentially. Yeah, well, market would recover on his case, but he would try to maybe he would sell out because he's thinking it's going to tank and then he's he's lost a shit ton of money. Anyway, Charles, Charles, I want to kiss and hug. I was kissing a bunch of Eth Ethereum guys. I kissed Ian, the delightful, I kissed him right on the cheek. Ian, Ian, share your picture. I also teach, kissed the other guy, the big guy. He's like, I watch all your videos, Mike. I was like, cool, you watch my videos. Um, yeah, I hugged, I hugged Vitalik. I hugged Vitalik because I'm his dad on the blockchain. Remember, I am ETC. I am the main blockchain. I am royalty. And Vitalik is the branch of me. He is my son. So, I have a vision, unlike anyone else, for ETC. And that vision is to use it to hard fork the planet from something called Kagger, which you'd be ignorant on if you were a developer, you'd be ignorant on if you're that guy who was trolling with me, right? But go and read my white paper and become educated on Kagger, and we're gonna basically hard fork it using Ethereum to something called Kaber. We're gonna build a whole planet based on good, not a whole planet based on what can I fucking rape from it. And that's my agenda. That's why I'm here. And that's why I'm not going. And that's why I'm going to turn that $10 million into $100 million. And I'm going to basically sue for the Dow. I'm going to win the Dow. And then every Dow is going to basically pay 1% of their gross annual average earnings to what? Found ups ETC Dow. And that's going to make ups basically free. Ups is going to be a ubiquitous coin. It's going to be the most sought after coin. It won't cost you anything to basically uh, change your BTC to Ups. It won't cost anything to when you mine ETC to Ups. It will be the coin that you're going to love because we are the upstarts and we're going to save the planet with found ups, which are D startups or decentralized startups on any blockchain because our DAO with API is gonna to connect to every blockchain. That's what my agenda is, Charles. Now what the fuck is yours?